Federal Highways. Mr. Speaker, I had shown you a video this morning that showed that the road was completely broken. And the House, based on the notes, that a gully has suddenly emerged on the Onitsha Oweri Express where around the rift, Ebusigo local government area and number state. The House further notes that this development has cut the expressway into two parts, leading to the entrapment of fuel tankers laden with diesel in the gully. The House is aware that it took the intervention of the personnel of the Federal Road Safety Corps to ensure that the contents of the trap tanker was transloaded while the remaining portion of the road remains closed to avoid loss of lives. The House is concerned that the Enugu on nature, that on nature over the express offers a bypass to several communities in the Southeast, as well as connects the Southeast and South-South political zones of the country. The House is worried that the present condition of the road has made the road completely impossible as some part as same poses great hardship to motorists, other road users, host communities, and constitutes threat to the lives of the people, hence the need for urgent government intervention. The House further notes that several portions of the Enugu Portacot Expressway are failing even while the contractor are, contractors are still on site. The House is worried that the rehabilitation works on the Enugu and Nature Expressway has been abandoned as evident in the immense hardship being experienced by motorists and other road users in the Amasia section of the expressway. The House is concerned that the economic well-being of our people is now in serious jeopardy, which can lead to a great humanitarian and security crisis. The House is cognizant of the precarious security situation across the nation, which may present opportunity to criminal elements to take undue advantage of these situations. The House resolves and considers expedient to call on the Minister of Works and Housing to commence urgent emergency repairs of the failed portion of the Onitsha Oweri Expressway with a view to easing hardship on motorists and Nigerians. The House should investigate the ongoing failure of strategic portions of the Enugu Portacot Expressway while the contractor is still carrying out rehabilitation works. The House should investigate the abandonment of the rehabilitation of Enugu and Nature Expressway, which has led to gory condition of Amansia section of the road, and report back to the House within two weeks. I so move. Honorable